As we look at Kirinyaga, the development we have achieved in these seven years, in these nine years Uhuru has ruled, is more than what we have achieved since we got independence. If we look at the roads which has been tarmacked, if we go to electricity connection, if we go to, we have a, 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 a dam, a very big dam built at, being built at Diva, which will increase production of rice by almost the rice in Moya. So when we, uh, we look at all these achievements, we won't like when Uhuru moves away, somebody would come and mess with the foundation he has built for this country. We would like somebody who can bring continuity to the development Uhuru has laid for us. And that is why we are saying, because we still need our piece of the national cake, we get together, make Jubilee strong. During 2022 election, we get more, more MCAs, we get MPs and the senators, whom the party can use to take motions in parliament that can benefit our, our country, Kenya. Sana sana wakati mama, governor alienda, akaolewa na vijana yake na watoto yake, Eh, hawa wengine na yo wakasema habana, wabu yu wameenda na watoto yake, eh, musee na ya mbaki na nani? Amembaki na vijana wengine hapa, wanataka mbandu, kuwa viongozi. Na kwa hivyo, President Yuhuru, haku mbaki peke yake, hako na watu on the ground and above. Na kwa hivyo, diyo naona, kama mama ameolewa na watoto yake, wale wa memufuata, wale wa membagi, diyo anapata blessings some Yes, that's the thing. Na kwa hivyo, wakati huu, sababu mama alienda, Kebiru ndi anashikiria hii county. Uh, wale wa unasikia wale wa kisema njumbiri imekufa, iyo ni matusi. Njumbiri iko na chairman, ambaye ndiye raisi wa Kenya. Na tunjawe sikia majisi ya raisi uhuru Kenya hata wana. <laughs> eh? Hii ni matusi straight away. <laughs> na ukisikia mutu yote na sema na muna hiyo, eh? eh, angalia ye sana kama akilisake siko timamu wana.